All right, today is an exciting day because Tana finally enters the official phase. Inside our membership, so many members keep asking, how can I enter Tana? We helped so many of you getting into the early access, but now that's coming to an end. You finally can join Tana and they're not just opening up, they're adding more features. But I shut my brain down. I didn't listen to anything. I saw these news coming up about Tana and I thought, let's make a reaction video about this because the moment I just opened Tana today, I found this. Paperless movement, your productivity, your way. Pop up there with the video and I thought, okay, before he dives into the features, let's do the video and let's see what's coming to the table. So let's dive in. Um, the first thing we see here already, unlock the most powerful features in Tana and get the Pioneer Prize. Well, Paco and I at the Paperless Movement, we love using Tana as our shallow thinking system, maybe even partly a deep thinking system in specific aspects. If you don't know what this is, make sure to check out the other video on our channel where we dive into how we use Reader versus Tana versus Heptabase for shallow and deep thinking. But here we are really excited because this is really an amazing note-taking app and we've been using all the others in the past like Obsidian, Logseek, Workflowy, Dynalist. Obviously there are outliners, Obsidian is something else, Obsidian is Markdown and then we have Rome Research and Notion and all these combinations. So again, we settled on these three apps and Tana is one of our core applications. So this means if somebody would remove Tana from our system, well then we would lose access. Luckily with the iCore tool agnostic approaches, we can easily move on to another tool, but we are not looking for other tools as we want to double down on Tana here. All right, so unlock the most powerful features in Tana and get the Pioneer Prize. $10 per month build yearly. And there we see it's $18 per month build monthly. And the Pioneer Prize is $12 per month build monthly. Well, is this much? For all of you out there, oh, I cannot, I cannot afford this no taking app anymore. And we had this discussion on the X going on as well. It's all about thinking about how much time this tool saves you. We are using three no taking apps, three PKM tools in order to manage our knowledge and being efficient on a daily basis. So you could say, how can you spend so much money on all these tools? Well, it is an easy calculation. If you save 15 minutes a day by having an efficient access to your knowledge, this will be sum up to 7.5 hours per month. And based on your hourly rate, that becomes a no-brainer to spend $10 a month <laughs> to pay for uh, an awesome application that enhances your superpower. So I don't know why this all, everything needs to be free mindset is coming from. This is something we always consider being great if a company finally starts charging for the tool because this means they can become sustainable and profitable and therefore keep growing and improving the tool. So let's dive in what we will actually get with the launch version. What's in the plan and shut up and take my money. Well, I'm tempted to click on this, but I want to see these new core features. Let's dive in. Hey, Tenarius. Exciting times are ahead. Tana is growing up. And we're thrilled to announce the launch of our beta subscription, Tana Core. This marks a significant milestone. So you see it's still in beta. All right, so they're just entering early access alpha into the official beta phase. And what they bring to the table already in the beta version is just amazing. Happy to support this. Features designed to supercharge your productivity. Here's what Tana Core brings to the table. Our first AI agent your new meeting assistant, which takes notes, finds tasks, makes summaries and so much more directly in your notes. Google Calendar integration, ensuring you never miss an important event. Our new AI chat, an enhanced version of ChatGPT, which lives inside your knowledge space. Okay, three thoughts to these three points here. Tana meeting agent. I saw something on X, somebody sharing this already, and I tried not to watch it, but I'm aware that Tana meeting agent is something that you can invite Tana to your meetings now. 
We are actually using MeetGeek right now for this. So it's transcribing our meeting notes and making summaries out of this. But having this Tana, having Tana inside meetings and get it directly into your PKM system, this is really amazing. The only question that arises is there, is now everybody who is using Tana inviting their Tana agents? So there will be then double the size of people in there, everybody using their own Tana. I don't know, but the advantage is really that you can have it directly in your PKM system. And as far I'm aware of this, that it's also automatically connecting with your databases into Antana. So if you talk about a person, it recognizes this person and tags the person accordingly in the meeting notes. Can't wait to dive into this to check it out. The Google Calendar integration. Well, I don't know if I need this in the PKM system. I know all the other tools like Notion, Evernote, all of them are now adding their calendars that you can show the calendar in your PKM. This makes really sense if this is the only tool that you're using, if you on your own as a knowledge worker. But as you know, in i for those who are following us know that in i we are connecting information with action. We are thinking about the business knowledge management and project management and therefore the teams. So we will have different tools for the action than we have for PKM and for planning things out. So I'm not sure uh, if this is really useful, having the Google Calendar integration there. This being said, obviously to start taking notes on certain meetings and this meeting is coming up and then you just click a button and you have a connection to these events, that's where the advantage comes in. Well, I have to check it out, how it's integrated in order to see more about this. And the Tana AI chat, amazing, if it works. So we've been using MEM in the past, for those who are following us know that. And well, they made some drastic changes in the past, that's why we moved on. And in fact, Tana was then replacing MEM. And now seeing Tana AI chat coming, I don't think there's a need to go back to MEM at all, because now I have the superpower of AI chat searching my knowledge base, but I still am able to give everything structure and create databases with super tags and so on. So amazing, let's go. Tana Publish with password protection for added security. Unlimited workspaces, 10 gigabytes of storage, unlimited file size uploads, audio enabled super tags. And amazing. Okay, so I have to check out all these things, but unlimited file size is very interesting. The question is really, I tend to have important documentation or things like that always on a sophisticated storage. So we are using Dropbox and, do, and Google Drive in order to have this storage. And then in any tool that we are referencing, in any tool that we need this documentation, we are just referencing with a URL out to the position inside the storage. That makes it safe. If I have to move on to another tool at some point, that all the crucial core documentation is available in one place. Also, you know, all the video editing files, for example, I wouldn't upload this to Tana, even if they have unlimited file size, but it's great. Ah, it's unlimited file size. Well, it's limited to 10 gigabyte, right? <laughs> so if I upload something that is beyond 10 gigabytes, then it's, it's full. So I don't know what this means then. And if you say, what file do you have with 10 gigabytes? Well, as I said, video editing files, things like that, you easily go beyond uh, 10 gigabyte of storage. So audio enabled tags and fields. I'm interested in to understand what this is actually all about. And uh, I think I saw something somewhere where it recognizes tags and fields when you're doing audio recording, but I'm not sure about this. Integrations, well, if it integrates with Sapia, this would be amazing. And it would become really a threat to MeetGeek, I have to say that. Because if we have Sapia and I can invite Tana to the meetings and I can make sense based on my knowledge management and then automate a specific other summary to be sent to our business knowledge management system, which is ClickUp using Sapia. Well, that opens so many opportunities uh, to to streamline our tool stack, let's put it this way. Voice input, I don't know. Um, we know voice capture, audio capturing in Tana Capture already. Live transcription, well, I have to check this out, man. Integrated AI features powered by the latest AI models. 
Here's a quick run through. So that's powered by the latest AI models. Um, they mentioned that they are no longer doing the chat GPT integration with your own API. I think it makes total sense because it makes it so much easier for a broader audience to access AI features that you don't need to sign up to uh, open AI and then get the API and too complicated for too many people. So therefore this is the right move. And they have the feature, they have the opportunity to know now combine different AI models into one tool. And this is really amazing, I think. Of some of the amazing things coming with Tonacore. Meeting recorders aren't great. I don't want to lock myself to one meeting platform and I don't want to go into yet another app to read AI summaries. I want my assistant to put to-dos on my task board and post-it notes on my desk about every person I'm meeting with. So this is the Tana Growth team. They don't know it yet, but they're helping me showcase the world's most powerful meeting agent. Wave hi guys. Starting now, your Tana assistant can join all your meetings. Zoom, Google Meet and Microsoft Teams. It live transcribes your meetings, so you can stay present knowing that none of the info will be lost. When your meeting finishes, Tana Meeting Agent does the processing for you. Action items appear on your task board. Any new entities like companies, places or people are filed in your database, so everything can be linked together. You have notes on your meeting. If this really works, man, this is so amazing. That's so powerful. And that, as I said, is really a threat to all the Fireflies, Meat Geek. There are so many others. Spine Edge, I think, is another one that solely do the transcription for you and make these meetings searchable. But having a direct integration inside your PKM system and connected things and just a few clicks of a buttons, if this works, this is the next big thing. No doubt about that. And there is no other alternative note-taking application or PKM system out there that would do it in such a great way as Tana is showing it here. Meeting attendees, and these are automatically updated by your meeting assistant. Congrats, you now have- For those who don't know, the, what's the point of having the meeting attendees there? So if the meeting attendee is on your person or people database inside Tana, you can search for a specific person, open this person up, and you see all the backlinks inside Tana to relevant information where you wrote something and you mentioned this person or had these meetings that are referred to this person. So this means whenever you go to this person, you have the single source of truth about this person, easily access anything related to this person. And this is really amazing. The magic robot meeting assistant that lives where your work lives. You can now invoke state-of-the-art AI inside your notes, and your knowledge makes AI more powerful. The Tana AI chat leverages the latest LLMs directly within your Tana workspace. You can now seamlessly transfer AI-generated content into structured formats within your knowledge base. With super tags, any object tagged in your AI chat inherits the structure and properties you've predefined, ensuring information is not only captured, but also correctly categorized. Amazing. That's exactly how you implement a chatbot inside a knowledge management system. You can also chat with any node, collaborating with AI with your specific knowledge in context. Press space on any empty node to invoke your assistant. I love the implementation. Press plus 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 at the end of- I love of the implementation because it is frictionless. I'm already in Node and Tana is really all about speed. We are using Tana only with our keyboard because that's what an outliner is all about. Having exactly this mindset moving forward with all the features, amazing. Any sentence you're struggling with to get AI to auto-complete it for you. You can set up smart fields, tags, and commands with custom prompts to automate workflows. You can set up workflows to structure and process your voice notes directly in your Tana. Amazing. In short, Tana AI is available everywhere. No context switching, no five new apps to work with AI. 
Tana AI lives where your work lives. Okay. Want to share your knowledge quickly and easily? Set up a Tana publish page with one click, two if you want a gorgeous header image, and password protect your page. Finally. Okay. Tana Meeting Agent, AI Chat, Autocomplete, Smart Fields, all of these features are designed to be easy to access for everyone. But Tana has an awesome community of builders, and we have not forgotten you in the new features. Your meeting agent is by default set up to find tasks and agenda items, but you can also set up your own agents. You can set up onboarding agents to find aha moments, bugs or user insights. You can set up interview agents to identify qualifying information about candidates. You can set up your agents however you like, and not just for meetings. Behind the power of the meeting agents is an architecture we call the text processing agent. You can access this when building your own commands. It can take any text, transcripts from voice memos, podcasts, meetings and videos, chapters from books, articles from the web, whatever, and extract and link up all the useful knowledge you want the way you want it. With commands, you can set up any automation flow in Tana, you know this. Now, we're introducing a game-changing feature to invoke these commands, events. Events are triggers you can set up to automatically run commands. They can be set up to run whenever a node arrives or leaves a location, or when the tag is applied or removed. In combination with AI commands like auto tag or move node, it allows builders to create complete apps inside of Tana. Okay, this is really amazing again. So they call it events. It's a, it's a trigger that triggers the automation. So it seems they're using the AI prompting and you improve it to build actual apps inside Tana. Man, make sure to follow this channel because I will play around with this and there will be some things coming up for sure. Let's keep moving on. All of these features are available today if you activate the Tana core plan. We can't wait to see what you build. Wow. No doubt. Shut up and take my money. And if you want to see how I go through the new features, make sure to subscribe to the channel and I will do a follow up video on this to show you exactly that. Thanks for watching and let me know in the comments below what you think about all these new Tana features and if you are as excited as we are at the Babyless Movement. See you next time. Bye bye. Everybody's talking about the